Hey guys, Danny Johnson here, and today we're going to be using the iPhone 12 Pro Max with the LiDAR sensor to uh, see IKEA's new app. It's called IKEA Place, and it uses the augmented reality AR using the LiDAR sensor on the phone to place furniture and show you what it would look like, how big it is, and you can move it around. So kind of a really neat concept, and so I'll show you how to do it. You'll just download the app from the App Store, and it's this one here, IKEA Place. So we'll go ahead and click on it. And when you go into the app, it has all the different categories of you know, shelves and lights and sofas and all kinds of stuff. So we're going to go ahead and pick one out here. We'll pick out one of these benches or little tables rather, and we'll see uh, how it looks inside the house and in the garage. So all we need to do is select uh, the piece that we want, and then at the bottom of the screen it has that little blue symbol, and you'll click on that in order to place it. And so here's here it goes. Uh, here's my uh, entry hall here. Let's go ahead and put it here and, and move it around. So you can pick it up and move it, and you can twist it. It's kind of cool, and it even has a little shadow underneath it, so you can kind of see what it would look like. And so... Um, as I was moving and playing it around, um, it was uh, actually pretty realistic looking. So let's go ahead and move it over here to the wall and put it down. See, this would be important if you wanted to make sure that the door would open or clear if you were going to put it here. And you can see there's still some space here and a ducky that I'll move. But uh, let's go ahead and pick it up and uh, continue to move it around here. Uh, the app's pretty easy to use. The only thing I want to mention is when switching from different furniture, sometimes it wouldn't go in, so I would have to uh, kill the app and then go back into it. So that worked out pretty good. Let's go into the garage. This is something I've wanted. I have this space between the toolbox and the uh, cabinets there, and so this is a perfect uh, tool to say if it would fit or and then how it would look. So <laughs> I had a lot of fun just picking it up and moving it around. And uh, you do have to be careful. It does uh, sometimes go into the wall. <laughs> so um, just place it where you want it and then just kind of walk around and see if it's what you would like and if it would fit. In this case, it looks like it would be just a little bit uh, sh more shallow than the cabinets. But uh, anyway, it gives you a really good idea of what it would look like in that area. So this is kind of fun technology. And uh, so I went ahead and played around with this a little bit more. And uh, I wanted to see if two of them would fit. <laughs> so I pulled up two of them, moved them around, and uh, they would not fit side by side. So that was, you know, good to know. <laughs> but it was kind of fun just playing around with these. And so as you can see, I kind of put that one down here, moved this one around over here. And yeah, they definitely would not fit side by side. And so I thought, well, maybe I can turn one sideways and see, you know, what it looks like in that way. So uh, I just selected the one that I wanted and just kind of kept spinning it around. And so it does a pretty good job showing you in sizes. As you move it away from you, it gets smaller and closer, it gets bigger. So here I put it in, as, as you can see, it kind of went into the wall a little bit. So I had to pick it back up and uh, move it around and, and set it back down. But uh, it really cool. It's really neat to show you what it would look like and how tall it would be compared to your other uh, furniture and stuff like that. So here's a, <laughs> a closet organizer. I decided to try to stash in here, see if it would fit. And definitely, you can tell that's going to be a little too big, so it's not going to fit in there. So uh, it is good to kind of give you an idea of how it's going to fit or how it's not going to fit in your home. So uh, they also have some other ones like this little chair. I decided to put a chair down here, see if I wanted to have a sitting chair next to the entry hall, a little stand here. And so just went ahead and placed it in, and there it is. <laughs> and so, yeah, you can kind of pick it up and spin it around and move it and, you know, do what you want with it. And so you can say, yeah, that's probably going to be a little too big for our sitting area, I think. I don't think that would fit there, and uh, it's floating over the dog right now. <laughs> And uh, so they also have lamps and, you know, all kinds of things that you can try placing in. And so a lot of fun to see how big they are, what they would look like, if they would fit even at all. And so we'll go ahead and put the lamp down here on the table. Yep, there it is. 
Yeah, let's see. Let's move it around here. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure I would like the size of that one, so that's good to know. And uh, so anyway, <laughs> you can see how fun this app can be to play around with.